debris that fell onto a home here in this neighborhood and subsequently knocked out the rest of the power and all of the surrounding homes. And now there are crews from Georgia Power that are working to handle these down power lines and restore the power. But the fire chief tells me it could be another six to eight hours. Now, the good news here is that there were no injuries. In fact, no one was home at the time when that tree fell onto that home. But I spoke with the homeowner and some of those family members who tell me they were in absolute shock to come home and see the extensive damage onto their house. And then we seen the tree and then we seen other people running from the pizza place over here where they heard such a loud boom and praise God we've been out to eat and we had just I got chills saying it but uh, we weren't here. Now this road is still closed because those crews have been working for the past three hours to deal with these down power lines and unfortunately the family tells me that there's too much damage to stay in that home tonight but they'll be staying with family. Now when residents can expect power to come back is late tonight maybe around 11 o'clock is what the pooler fire chief tells me so residents should just be sitting tight if you're in one of these neighboring homes. For now reporting in pooler tonight Sierra Lucas WJCL 22 news.